Well, oh. Enemies! Uh, okay, this is the last mobile sprout fight we'll keep in. Mm. So, what I got for Christmas, we, uh, her mom got me the Paul McCartney book, she got me the Dave Grohl book, she got me Super Monkey Ball Banana Mania. Yeah, it was on sale for half off at Target on Black Friday. So Only $20. I, like, oh God, I have to get that for him now. I already knew about it when she bought it. She yeah, also she... got me uh, the Metroid Dread Amiibos, even though I don't have Metroid Dread yet. Uh, Samus and the E-M-M-I, the Emmy. So I'm very excited about that. Uh, they only took two PP, barely did any damage. Okay. But I kept looking for the Animal Crossing Series 5 Amiibo cards for like a month. Oh. All of December. Hello, this is the Apple Kid. I just finished work on this great invention. I forgot his voice. Get over here as fast as you can. This thing is so cool. See you soon. Slam. Beep. Yeah, that's okay, baby. But you use I that couldn't find that at all because we live like in a small place. So the Target, like, I don't know. You'd think that you could find them better because there's not as many people wanting them here because we live in the middle of nowhere with just a bunch of old people. Um... Well, it's just that they don't stock them. Yeah. It's not that they go out of stock. Like, I saw them one day, but they didn't have Series 5. They had all the other series except for 5. Wait, and what, I was at like, Target? Well, yeah. Really? Their series 5 just came out, and I was like, well, I want Series 5. I don't want the other ones right now. Cause... Oh, because they restocked the originals yeah. very briefly. Oh, thank God. I'm so glad we did not attack ourselves, because I don't want to waste time staying in the hotel again. Oh, God. Oh, great. <laughs> oh, we can get some more PP back. Ooh, yes, let us heal. God, Life of Alpha is so useful for so long. He's running away from you. Yeah, because they don't want to land on our head, I guess. <laughs> I don't know why they run away from us. I've never thought about it. Oh, God. This is not good. Uh, I can handle this. Their worst attack, they can't do it to me right now. We can kill them in one hit. Oh. Oh, God. When the smash came up after uh, I was feeling funky, that <laughs> terrified me. Imagine doing 130 damage to myself. It wouldn't have been that much, probably. Because, you know, we have higher defense than the Rambling Evil Mushroom. Uh, but if you don't invest in Apple Kid. You cannot progress in the game. <laughs> so, you just have to really explore the town. Oh. Are you looking for that so-called genius Apple Kid? As a true genius, I'll tell you that he's in Berglund Park looking for you. Go to his house. Thanks, buddy. His house is empty. Oh. No I point. I just lying. No. <laughs> he is not. And I already know where he is. Fun fact. You... Oh! Another magic butterfly. Okay. I'll take it. I'll, I'll keep max HP and PP. That'll be very useful. I am a mouse. My master, Apple Kid, has been waiting for you. We started to nod off while waiting. I'm feeling really out of it because I've been working all night. No time has passed, buddy. But finally, the pencil eraser is ready. This machine will eradicate all pencil-shaped figures in just one second. It's incredibly Whoa, powerful. that sounds useful. <laughs> just don't use it near a shop that sells pencils. Here, it's yours now. Ness got the pencil eraser. If I invent some other brilliant item, I'll call you. Ooh. We need to go to the hospital. Uh, oh yeah, I could do that, couldn't I? I was just gonna use the girl uh, at the entrance. But we could get Sell into it. some fights on the way there. She she buys it for $50 too. Oh, okay. So, but you're right. If we get into fights and I get a smash attack on myself. All right, well, we'll meet you back. Uh, well, guys, before we go off back to the Peace Forest Valley, I have decided to have a change of heart. You didn't invest any money in my venture, but someone else donated a few million bucks, so everything is great. So would you like to invest, say, 50 bucks? Oh, come on! That's exactly the amount of money I got from selling a mushroom. I thought it was 100. Your support should have a tremendous impact on all mankind. Let me give you my new Super Orange machine. I call it Suporma for short. Aha! You have too many items! I hope you'll accept the Suporma, even if you have to toss some of your food. Hmm. Fun fact, everybody. Uh, the bicycle shop, shop puncture. Uh, is 
translated it was a more apparent joke in the japanese version but it's basically a joke about puncturing the tires that's what i got that's what i figured i i didn't get that until uh <laughs> very recently all right this is what i'm gonna do because this is what the escargo express is for sure let's do a pickup uh you have any money first no i have enough money but i want to get rid of the rest of my money so 50 minus 18 is 38. 32. Oh, 32. <laughs> you were close. I thought you said two instead of eight. We're getting better at that three. mental math thing since Donkey Kong Jr. math five years <sighs> I ago. Play that. So what did you guys get for Christmas? You oh, already we, asked you already time. asked that. That's right. Thank you, baby. Here we go. Enjoy this song. We are going to get rid of Okay, we'd have to call him all over again if he actually ends up taking the soundstone because I don't want to get rid of it. I don't think he'll take it though. Get rid of the first cell sign. He won't take the ATM card. Get rid huh? of the first cell sign. Um, yeah, I am. We're also going to get rid of the town map because that's pretty useless. It kind of sucks. It's an item now when in the first game it was just a button because the Y button, for instance, does nothing on this controller. So it could have been, or the X button, That's just, that only brings up the map. So why couldn't that have just been a permanent thing? It doesn't really matter, but uh, bicycle, we don't need that anymore. Uh, ooh. Actually, since he can only take three items at once, we'll give him the broken machine, because we can't use that right now. Where'd you get that? Uh, that was in Apple Kid's garbage can. Oh, okay. So next time, we'll get rid of the for sale sign, because I will not be using it very often. <sighs> Ooh, narrowly avoided getting hit there. <laughs> now I regret giving away the bicycle yeah. instead of something else, but it's not like we could be using it much longer anyway. What the heck? It's the lady that stole the kale. <laughs> Her favorite food in Earthbound Beginnings was kale. Uh, so, of course, on this channel, it's a chili. He said he flew. He's so full. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Fat ass. Doesn't even give me the option, even though it gives us free money. What? Excuse me? She ate five chilies? Then ran away without paying. If you see her, let me know. Oh, I have a good feeling of who it is. She ate all the chili! Oh, so she stole the chili? She, she stole the chili! Did I talk? No, I, I got a Hormel chili shirt for Christmas. Oh, My yeah. mom got me a shirt that has the Hormel chili logo on it. No idea where she got it. I think she told me, but I can't remember. No, she just Googled Hormel Chili like merchandise. Did she really? Yeah, that's what she said. Oh my her. god. Yeah. She Googled Hormel Chili merchandise. And another magic butterfly. We are getting as lucky as humanly possible. And then, not that Wait, night. Wait, what is wrong with me? We gotta go back. Why? The reason why we went to Escargot Express I actually don't want to fight you guys right now. So, we'll do this. Oh my god! We don't need that right now, but uh, we oh, forgot... We to to yeah, Orange Kid, we Orange forgot to get his Suporma. Speed this up. Ooey mama. I like how they have signs by their houses. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Ness got the Suporma. Please use it for spreading peace and goodwill on Earth. I'm hard at work. Don't worry. My brilliant invention will be ready soon. Okay, okay. I'll get back to work. Suporma. Orange Kid's invention. The full name is the Super Orange Machine. Not very descriptive. The Suporma sang the song Ode to Orange Kid. As soon as it finished, the machine broke down. <laughs> it's gone from our inventory. You just wasted fifty dollars. Two hundred if you invested in him originally. Speed this up. Zooey Mon. Zoo no, I'm not doing that joke twice. You already did it. I'm gonna cut that part out. First time I'm not. 
No need to show this either. Oh, oh, never mind. Hey, we are getting stronger every moment. Almost at every minute of the day. That's not true. We're not playing it every minute of the day because they want us to take a break every two hours. Fun fact, in the Japanese re-releases, they change it to an hour. Your dad will call you every hour to line up with Nintendo's modern standards of an hour. Then I think they lowered it to every 30 minutes you should take a break. Don't know why. They've never had any legal disputes over this. They just want to avoid it. Like for, you know, if you hurt your eyes or oh, you yeah. get lazy, you know, because the night, this was the peak of parents being like, oh, kids are rotting or <laughs> kids are rotting my parents' brains. That's what I was about to say. Video games are rotting my kids' brain. Which, you know, they were spending all their time doing. Which is ironic because, you know, my parent, my dad would say that to me, but he spends all of his time watching TV. So. This is even worse than, yeah, um. Yeah, this is games. interactive. This yeah. taught me to read really well. This is Sims why I can read so well. Sims taught me, like, the, the word miscellaneous. And then yeah. Tin Dogs uh, taught me famished and parched. Yeah, I learned so many words from Nintendo Dogs of Sims. Yeah. Uh, Pokemon. I learned the word custom from Pokemon. I play Pokemon. There it is. Pencil too late in life to learn anything from it. Yeah, that's true. But I remember I kept asking my mom what custom meant. I was like, I know you told me. No, that was naive. Every time that SpongeBob episode would come on, which one? Uh, where somebody would call somebody else naive, and I'd be like, okay, mom, I know I asked you this not long ago. What does naive mean? And she had trouble describing it because it's a word that's, you know, hard to describe. It just means you mm. believe things easily. Yeah, I guess you're right. It's not that hard. Good point. <laughs> I, t I retract my statement. <laughs> ooh, ooh. No, thank you. This is a territorial oak. We are going to do the off screen trick again. We are going to be fighting plenty of enemies in here, so I'd rather not. No! <sighs> That's hilarious, by the way, the fact that Tree runs. All right, this is going to be a spinning robo. Listen to this song. Uh, I believe this is Battle with a Machine? Dude, we're going to get so high battling all these people. Why, because the, the video, video drug? <laughs> Wow, he's actually doing semi-substantial damage. What a nerdy sentence that was. Right, that's one of my favorite battle <laughs> backgrounds, if not my favorite we battle have to background. Get that present. You can actually get it from down here. It's just really hard to do. Well, that would take like probably 10 minutes of me trying and then giving up. <laughs> but we'll get it the, the hard way and hopefully encounter some more new enemies along the way. None. The travel charm! Don't get it in. We already have one equipped. <laughs> Ooh! Because mm. well, we just equipped it. I'm gonna keep it actually. Um, Why are there no enemies? Yeah. We are just getting insanely lucky. Uh, I don't know if there's anything down here. I don't think this is the way to go. I got really Oh, this lost. is where we just went. Okay. Yeah, I got it just lost here. Yeah, it's easy to get lost I here on your it. first time through. And you know, I just got sorta of lost. Your time through. Uh, the Peaceful Rest Valley is another point in the game that's actually kinda difficult because it's it's a longer dungeon. And uh, uh, there are no rambling evil mushrooms in Peaceful Rest Valley. They're only on the cave to it. Uh, so you don't have to worry about going all the way back. Or trekking the rest of the way through mushroomized, thank god. Mushroomized. You're right. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> I would have been amazed if we could have killed both, like, <laughs> insta one with two of them. We can cut this out. You love a good mobile sprout. Oh, I adore a good mobile sprout. They kind of look appetizing to me because I like to, uh. Yeah, I like spinach. Yeah, I like to, uh, you know, oh, basil, sprinkle Italy, herbs. Basil. Yeah, I like to sprinkle herbs and food. Yeah. I love to just straight up eat cilantro. You know, like, like the, yeah, like the whole joke okay. about, like, how white people don't season their foods? Well, we're, we season our foods, like, way too much. But, like, to where it's <laughs> good, like, like, the majority of our food will just be seasoning. But it's, we use, like, dried herbs, and sometimes we use fresh herbs. 
Oh yeah, her it garden had, like, was so garden. good. And but I forgot to, uh, I didn't look at the frost date and my basil died. <laughs> I had three plants of what, We flourish. still need to find the basil that you have yeah, dried. Yeah, I know. He gets a smash attack, we're screwed. I dried some Actually, basil, but it's lost in the pantry somewhere. I think we're screwed. I think I just killed us. Uh-oh. Unless we get lucky. We did. We went first. <gasps> he mostly goes first. Oh, yay. Oh, my yeah. God. I am a god. If I don't die again, I'll be happy. I'll be happy with a one death run because that means, uh, you know, uh, I've gotten to show the death screen and the death song. So that's nice. Is this the only food we have? Okay. That's only seven HP. Yeah, skip sandwiches suck, but they make you run so you can outrun enemies. No! Oh. Oh, Territorial Oaks can team up with uh, Mobile Sprouts. This is another neat background. Was that a Territorial Oak right huh? beside it? Yes. I thought it was a normal tree at first because it was, you know, clipping with that uh, tree behind it. Oh, yeah. Uh, and that ran out very quickly. I wonder who made the bridge impassable. Why would someone do this? Crud. <laughs> He's just standing there the whole time. Croissant! Those are the best healing items. Let's eat it. Well, best commonly found healing items. Oh, item. wait, we don't need it. Yeah, 60 HP. So, finally, something better than hamburgers. We've really come a long way today. And... A bomb! I'm not going to show, show you what this does. Damage an enemy when used during battle. Because of its explosive power, it may affect others besides the, uh, the target creature gone after one Does use. that mean you or just other enemies? Uh, I think you can use it on yourself if you're feeling funky, but I'm not sure. Watch over that tree up there. Yeah, I probably just despawned all those enemies, though. Because I went the wrong way. Oh, they yep. Do. Oh, watch out. So, right there. No, the, these oh, shaped trees are um, not ever enemies. Uh, okay, there's nothing up there. Great. Oh, this is what Watch out for him! Up. Yeah, I know. They're actually no! kind of slow. No! I, what? I ran into the wall like an idiot. Oh, well, at least you get to see them. They're not that bad, but you do want to run away. Is this our first time running away from a battle? It is no longer a 50-50 shot. Uh, it's actually pretty complicated. I've never seen the numbers. Uh, I read online one time. What are you so doing? This is what I do. To get out of battles oh, in this right. game, do that. I don't think it actually has basis in the code, but it's the best thing I've found. It's one of those old superstitions. The more turns go on, oh, listen, I love it. I love that screen effect too. Brain shock almost never works, but it also it basically is mushroomization, mushroomization. Go go go! No, they despawn when oh, you run. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah. Do they do that, Mother Three? I don't think they do. I don't Stop think they do. Stop bringing up Mother 3! Sorry! Oh, I was oh, asking! I am her. Uh, no, they don't. Okay, I think so. Actually. See, that's another reason this game's easier. I think they don't, at least. Oh, freak yeah. Yep. You just Ooh. love my second piece. I know. What is to the south of that bridge that? area? Because I know this is an optional way to go, and it's very worth your while. Because is there something good at the end? Yep. That? Yep. Another hat that we don't have to buy. Yeah, we are going to go ahead and do Use something. Use the first sign. Yep. I always do this here because I think I saw Chuck Conroy do this in his 2008 playthrough of Earthbound. <laughs> Hi, is this a tool shop? Cool. Why do they all think that? Uh, what is it? Oh, it's up there. Duh. $99. Ooh, thanks a lot. It was sure worth it to come all the way out here. <laughs> and then he runs into the dead end. They actually struggled so hard. That was one of the reasons they were almost giving up on the game's coding. They really wanted... They thought it would be funny to have the guy from wherever you are just be able to come from nowhere. Oh, we just made enemies spawn, and I'm despawning them because it's territorial oak. Okay, we're good. Uh, we're maxed out, aren't we? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, 150 and 50. Nice. Spiteful crow. crow? Can we fight him? 
Let me see if I can... No, there's a... Oh, oh, no. Sometimes you can clip through cliffs that way. But we saw that little cabin over there. Oh, uh, we're despawning that. I don't think there's anything down there. I think it's a dead end. It just takes, I know, but I'm not worried about him. He doesn't team up with the robot enemies. Oh, okay. We haven't fought the little UFO. <gasps> I know you've... Right. Oh, there! I've been waiting for that. Well, That's why I wanted to keep the cold remedy for a while. Yeah. I thought you said you weren't going to use it. Yeah, I, I probably wasn't going to use it, but uh, this guy, they they normally do that a lot, see? But we've been getting lucky, and he's been doing damage to us instead. Uh, every time it's your turn, and while you're on the field, as I will demonstrate, like an idiot, because I'm just willingly taking damage, you might not be able... Um, there it is, in case you saw that flash. Uh, it does damage on the field. Might not very much. Remedy. Because I sold it, remember? Oh, you did? A cup oh, of life no. noodles! That will revive a dead or otherwise incapacitated party member. God, I'm really not sure if there's something down there. I'm almost positive there's nothing down there, so I'm not going to go down there. Come on, I want to fight the mobile sprouts. Okay, well. I'm going to be really upset. I'm going to look at a map. Uh later and i will come all the way back here <laughs> later in the game if i screwed up and there is an item down there but i'm like 90 okay i'm like 75 percent sure there's not one i'm surprised we have not been having a tough time in no. this forest valley or you know at least a tougher time than this oh we'll get to find out right now because it connects Okay, cool. Oh. Nope. It doesn't. Ah, <laughs> uh, well. We'll find out one day. Here we go, a nice cave. 